Hello, my name is Jean Quintus and I am publishing a new fly every month on my website www.mekejang.lu You see it there. The fly of the month of July 2014 is a glitter wet fly. To tie this fly we will use a Tiemco 2487 or Kamazan B100 in size 12 up to 16. A black medium tying thread. The body will be made with Myla Tinsel Pearl. The thorax will be made with ice dubbing brown or olive. For the heckle we will use a natural partridge feather and in addition we will need some UV glue. We will tie in the thread at the eye of the hook and wind a neat bed down into the curvature of the hook. When we have finished the bed, we will wind the thread back in direction of the eye of the hook and cut off the excess of tying thread. Then we will tie in the pearl mylar tinsel close to the eye and wind it in close windings down into the curvature of the hook. Arrived in the curvature of the hook, we will wind the Myla tinsel back to the eye of the hook. Here we will tie off the tinsel and cut off the excess of the Myla film. Then we will apply a drop of UV glue on top of the Myla film and distribute it evenly over the whole body. This is best done with a needle. When we are satisfied we will cure the body using our UV torch. To create the thorax of the fly, we will twist some ice dubbing in the split thread. To split the thread, we have to first remove the remaining twist from the thread. This is best done using two needles and making the movements as shown here. After a certain time, you will see that the thread is being flat on top of one of the needles.
That is the moment where we are going to insert the second needle into the thread to split it. Then we will insert a pinch of eye stubbing into this split thread and rotating our bobbin we will fix it in the split thread. Then we will wind the thorax with this dubbing strand. Using our scissors we trim the dubbing fibers which are a little bit too long. For the front tackle we will use a partridge feather which we will prepare as shown here. We will tie in the tip of the feather close to the eye of the hook, cut off the excess of the feather and then wind a wet hackle with this feather. We clamp the feather into our hackle pliers Pull back all the fibers to the rear and wind a first turn. Then we pull again all the fibers into the direction of the curvature of the hook and wind the second turn. Always pull back all the fibers. Then we tie off the feather cut off the excess of the feather and wind the head of the fly To finish the fly we will whip finish the head and cut off the thread. You can download the detailed tying instructions for this fly and for all the previous ones on my website www.mekijang.lu Leave a message in the guest book with your email address and I will send you a mail every time a new fly is published. See you in Tidelines!